Hi, this is David Avery with Air Mountain Radiator, and this video is on how to adjust a pocket thermometer. Um, it was <laughs> I had a couple of years before I learned how to do this, and what you do is you take some ice water. Ice water is 32 degrees, so you grab a glass, fill up with ice, put some water in it, and that's what we're going to use as our test medium. You put your pocket thermometer in the ice water and then the ice water should read 32 degrees. If it doesn't, then you're going to have to adjust your thermometer. These pocket thermometers, almost all of them are adjustable, and we'll show you how to do that at the uh, end of the video. So here we go. I make a spot for it and stick it in glass. And now it should read 32, and if it doesn't, then we adjust it back down. Um, this is a pretty new thermometer. I just bought this a couple weeks ago. Um, I go through two or three of them a year, it seems like because we use them a lot and uh, we recalibrate them a lot too. You want to know when you're doing air conditioning work that um, it is blowing 45 or 42 or whatever it says it's blown. It needs to be blown out at the vents. So it's um, it's important for it to be accurate. This one's right about at 32. I'm sorry it's so fuzzy but I can't get my camera to to, uh, to clear up those real close shots. So, But anyway this one is at 32 but I'm going to show you how you adjust it anyway. What you do is you take and you flip it on around the back and you see that nut right there I'm pointing out. There's a little nut right there. You put an adjustable wrench on that nut and that nut, um, you hold that nut and then you turn the dial. And as you turn the dial, it actually moves the dial and the uh, the little red pointer um, line thing stays, stay, the, the little dial stays in place as you move that back and forth. The dial moves and the pointer stays in place. So that's how you do it. That's how you uh, adjust the pocket thermometer. Um, yeah, uh, glad that uh, you guys stopped by. Thanks for watching the video, and we will see you next time. Intermountainradio.com. If you have any questions or comments, go to our website. Our uh, phone numbers are there. Always happy to help out. Thanks for watching. Bye.